my name is Rastas Boy, County Commissioner Nakuru. This being a, uh, a government project that is uh, uh, meant for construction of an airport, and this is an airport that will be serving as a civilian and military airport. And, uh, it is our responsibility to check, not only to update ourselves on what is happening, but if there is any obstacle that is there, we can also bring it to the attention of the government and also try to somehow unlock if there could be any bottleneck that we can be able to unlock at our local level with the local community and explain to them what is happening here so that they can be able to have that right of information. This airport is part of many other projects that the government is undertaking in the country, largely aimed at improving the well-being and the livelihoods of our people. Our government is committed to ensuring that uh, we are able to move from the level that we are economically to the next level. And to do that, we must be able to build a very strong foundation upon which we can be able to um, place other forms of development. Now with this airport here having been completed, it will only, not only create employment for those who will be employed here, but even the farmers will be able to easily transport their farm produce to other parts of the, of, the, of the country to abroad. And by doing so, they'll also be able to create employment in the farms. So you can see the multiplier effect that is going to be generated by this project. I am glad that uh, the engineers are on site, they are doing a lot of work, we can see the progress being done, and according to them, this project is slated to end by the year 2022, August 22nd, and from the assurance we will be able to meet that target. And I'm certain that certainly, yes, that target will be, uh, will be met. Our government is committed to developing this country. And our government is committed to ensure that nobody is left behind.